What's up, YouTube? This is your girl, Quinn81. Today has been a rainy day in the Dallas Fort Worth area, better known as DOW. It has been raining all day today, all day yesterday. Yes. Unfortunately, I had to get out and get a couple of items uh, to go with some dinner that I was making for my husband. Um, made some lasagna so I needed some corn and green beans or whatever to go with it so I went out to go get it to be honest with you I didn't feel like going to Walmart or any Kroger I went to the Dollar Tree went got me some Libby corn and green beans um, so that's what I did and plus it was closer to me I just didn't feel like going and standing in lines, parking, and ugh. you know how it is around this time, you guys. But yes, it was. it's rainy and cold outside. It is. Let me see how many uh, degrees it is outside. Yeah, it's uh, pretty cold. It's 44 degrees outside now, but of course, it's like 10, 10 central time right now. But anyway, when I went in there, of course, you guys know that I have like an issue <laughs> with things that are sour. So I saw these uh, neon worms. They're pretty good. They are pretty good from what I've tasted so far. You know, I like the Walgreens and the trolley is. It's okay. The Walgreens is really good. But the neon worms, they're not bad. And they were a dollar from the Dollar Tree. And then I love toffee. So you know that I love toffee, sour candy, like Sour Patch Kids, Sour Straw, Sour Punch, whatever you want to call it, and then these neon worms. And then I had to get my toffee peanuts from the Dollar Tree as well. Butter toffee peanuts. And it was um, $1 as well. But before I got to the snack, ah, ladies, lately it's been a hot mess. I've been in here showing you what I've done yeah I went in I saw this pop duet by L'Oreal L'Oreal <laughs> and this one it's like in the green like olive green and light green I'm about to open it up for you guys oh, it's in here too this plastic but yeah this was a dollar yeah it was a dollar L'Oreal and it's a double jumbo size pencil. Let me take this top off so you guys can see. It's like an olive green. God, this is on here good, isn't it? They don't want anybody to open this pencil. Oh my God. You guys, it's on here. Let me try another one, okay? But anyway, it's like a green. A green light green and it's like almost similar to like um if not like the coastal scents like uh duo liners these this is the pop duet um and it's uh, pretty much an eyeliner and shadow actually i can't get that top off of that guys i'm gonna have to work with that i don't want to do something like this and you know hit myself in the face i can't get that top off yeah, so I bought that one. And then I also got a Pop Duo. Wait a minute, let me see something. Okay, this is strange, guys. One of these, as you can see, one of them has a plastic wrapper around it. I don't know if you guys can see that. See that plastic wrapper that's around there? This green one that I just opened does not have a plastic wrapper on here. However, it's on here good and as if it did have a plastic wrapper on here. I know. So I'd have to really, let me get to this plastic to see if this one, which is a light purple, like a lilac color, like a lilac color. And then also like a dark purple. Uh, and it's, again, this is shadow. And it's also 
a liner. So I'm just going to try to open this up. Hope I don't tear a nail. I mean, break a nail. I'm trying to do this, y'all. Oh, where the scissors when you need them? I didn't think I was going to need any scissors. But, um, let's see. Gosh, this plastic is on here, guys. I mean, it's, it was already in here. But I guess they want to make sure they protect their products. So I guess I can't knock them for that. Put my straps up. But yeah, um, it's crazy. It's really crazy. Um, but And this just comes off. Look, isn't that crazy? Alrighty. <laughs> now I wish this one, the other one would have been wrapped up like that as well because I mean I could just once I get this plastic off it can just come off I'm not worried about it because I know that it was obviously wrapped up where no one could get in and try to test this out I'm not sure if they decided to change the way they wrap their packages or what anyway this is the purple Ooh, I didn't already got it oh it's really creamy guys Okay, so I'm going to do a swatch so you guys can see I have no primer or anything on my hand. However, my hands are clean. I'm going to do a swatch for you guys. Can you see that? It's very pigmented. Oh, guys, I just broke the pencil for the purple side. I was going to show you guys. Let me see if I can drag this color along. As you see, I just broke it that's pretty but I have a sharpener somewhere around here you know so I got a blue one too guys a blue one and of course it's all wrapped up in the package as well dark blue and there's like a light baby blue so let's get this thing open this one wasn't wrapped up good but at least I know that nobody was in it because it was inside this plastic, you know, thingamajig package. Yeah, not thingamajig, guys. But yeah, it's been a long day. Today I was off from work today. I took off for today. As you can see, I have no makeup on because I've been pretty much chilling around the house. I've been chilling around the house. The only time I even walked outside was to take the dog outside and to go run this errand which I just ran in and ran out so nobody would see me. I'm just playing. But yeah, um, it's pretty bad outside. I don't, when it's raining and storming outside, and I just want to stay in. I don't want to go out. I'm a homebody, so I don't want to come out of my house. If I had a choice to be another animal other than, uh, you know, if I have trust to be an animal other than being a person, I will probably choose, well, i choose a dog because they seem to have it easy. Sassy is back there eating her food and now she's about to sleep. She sleeps all day. All day. All day. But then when you pull her out of her house, because she has a crate, a large crate at that for a big dog. She has a lot of space in there. She, she runs around here like she's I don't know, in a dog show or something. But, um, a groundhog. They only come out once I, they don't really come out of their home uh, often, so I'd be a groundhog because I'm a homebody. That's what I'm comparing. I can't get this top off of her. Guys, there it go. Oh. Okay, but anyway, here is the blue. Let me try to make more. Damn it, every time, <laughs> we could be cussing on YouTube. Every time I try to write with it, it's you know because it's sharper and that's the dark color y'all see that and I'm gonna do the light color but I'm gonna do this gently because I don't want to break this goodness grief and that's the light color now I need to do the greens I need to do the green so let me try to yank this top off of here Good Lord, they don't want nobody in here. <sighs> Guys, this is ridiculous. It really is. 
This is ridiculous. I cannot get this green off of here. Hot mess. Let me try twisting this thing. Ugh. It won't come off at all, guys. I'm going to have to ask my husband to do this because I can't do this. And it's hurting my hands. It just won't come off. But anyway, anyway, y'all can see that it's a light green. And a purple. I mean, not purple, but a dark green. It's really pretty. All in all, I think these shades are really pretty. Looks like they blend pretty well. Take on it off. But yeah, I'm happy with this purchase. Hey, it was only a dollar. It was only a dollar for each shade. And I'm getting two pencils in one. It's a duo. See? And again, it's called Pop Duo by L'Oreal. So, it's not bad at all. But yeah, I'm happy with that purchase. So I can't wait to use it because it's really pretty. As you guys can see, I don't have any makeup on. I've been in here chilling pretty much. And I'm probably going to go in there and rest. Because it's time. And it sounds like my husband's probably almost here. Mm -hmm. We're in an apartment. And every time he walks to the door, all the doggies start barking. Yeah, a lot of people in this uh, complex have doggies. <laughs> so yeah so you guys I like this product and it seems creamy seems like it's a good product you know I can't wait to try it you know you get under here and line your eyes oh but yeah it looks like it's a good product very creamy if you're not going to use this as a um a, a liner as it states you can always use it as eyeshadow because it's also an eyeshadow so but yeah it blends pretty well take the stuff off my face y'all but it's really pretty i like it i'm glad i bought it because i've been debating whether i should buy the one uh for coastal sands but um you know the ones for coastal sands it comes like um what was I gonna say like um, a pack of maybe like maybe six different jumbo pencils but two different colors of course because it's duo and um, duo and it's uh, $20 it's a collection or yeah it's like a collection so uh, I don't think those go on sale if they do go on sale you know I'll let you guys know you know because I would like the other colors but I may just have to order the other colors individually because there was a gold and it was like a yellow light color that I want so now I, I can just buy that you know buy the other two ones because I think it's one like a I don't know I have to look on their site but it's probably like two more colors two or three more colors that I may purchase from them you know since I've got these there's no point in just getting um, buying some more dual pencils since I was able to get these uh, for a dollar at my uh, Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree had a lot of things in there. They had the LA Colors uh, eyeshadow too and stuff like that. Some of you like the LA Colors. I've never tried them. To me they look like NYX palettes. You know, lower grade of NYX palettes. And NYX they have pretty good eyeshadow too. I have a lot of their palettes around here too. Maybe I'll do a tutorial on that, but lately I have been on my coastal scents because I am really happy with their product and I see that everybody has been talking about it on here, you know, for the last two years and I didn't know what the heck it was, what company it was. I just feel like I've been in the dark. But for some reason, that name Coastal Scents kind of seems, uh, sounds familiar. I don't know if they used to sell their products inside of a beauty supply house because I remember back in the day there were some palettes like that but they were really small they were like squared big big palettes kind of like the way they make it with the mirror with the colors it was kind of squared so I wonder if back in the day if they had their products in beauty supply stores or if beauty supply stores purchased them, their items and 
put them in their store. But this was back in the day, like in high school.